checked into the most beautiful hotel and hotel room and I feel like I'm in a rom-com movie or something because this experience was insane. So I got picked up from the airport and when we, I arrived at the hotel, a guy waited for me with an umbrella. He picked up my luggage, went with me to the hotel and talked about the room and everything. And I'm here with rituals and they brought so many nice products here with me. And oh my God, I just want to scream. <laughs> it's so crazy. The time is now 9 p.m. and I'm a little hungry, so I will order some room service. Never done that before either. So, you know, living the girl dream. I met a girl from Prague. She's working with Vogue. How cool is that? We took the same cap here. And oh my god, they were so kind. And I can't wait to explore the city and be with rituals. Like, this is the dream. Like, I'm forever grateful for everything. Oh my god. <laughs> and the hotel room is so nice. I can't wait to sleep in this beautiful bed and eat dinner and relax and yay. I will like maybe take a shower and grab the food, try some products, just relax. And yeah, I'll show you the rest of the room. And then I will see you guys tomorrow for an exciting day with rituals where we have a lot on our schedule but i will try to bring you guys along as much as i can thank you bye thank you <laughs> oh sorry there's some Good morning guys! Today it is Thursday the 22nd of February and I just had breakfast. Lovely breakfast at the Pillow, Ho Pillow Hotels here in Amsterdam. And I had an avocado toast and some shia uh, porridge and it was so so yummy. And the hotel, I haven't seen all of it yet but it's beautiful. Like it's in an old school university building and you can still see a lot of it here um, when you're going through the halls and outdoor. I will uh, do my makeup. I just did like the foundation concealer and stuff but I will still need to apply some mascara and then I think I would like to go out for some air before our schedule starts with rituals. It starts at 10.45 and the time is now around 8.30 so I thought that it would be nice to get some fresh air because I'm a little tired because the past few days I haven't slept that much but it's okay I'm grateful to be here and to experience Milan but now I'm here in Amsterdam so my mindset just needs to like focus on that I'm now here in Amsterdam instead of Milan <laughs> finish doing my makeup brush my teeth and then I will get out of the door get some fresh air and then maybe grab a coffee somewhere an ice latte I don't know what it is with me but I only like cold coffee I don't, why, I don't know why. <laughs> um, so I would like an ice latte, maybe somewhere, or a matcha. There's one close here, so maybe I will go there. Because it's not raining, but it's totally different weather compared to Milan. So I also need to think about that. But we have an exciting day ahead of us, and I will try to bring you guys along as much as I can. And this hotel room, oh my god. I, like yesterday, I also said it, but I wanted to like scream of happiness because it's so pretty here. And I'm so grateful to be experiencing all of this like with my job it's insane like i feel like i'm in a movie or i don't know if it makes sense <laughs>
little update for you guys. I'm currently having a mocktail and it tastes like summer. We are at Vandal Park at this beautiful place where we had an introduction of the Sakura uh, collection and their new additions. You guys, it smells amazing. Then had a Japanese tea where we made tea for our um, the person who sat next to us and it was such a fun, cute and cozy ritual to do and now there's a workshop where you can paint or write a letter for someone you care about to be very present and do something for your body soul and mind and after that we will have lunch in this beautiful place and i already filmed a few scenes from in there and it's so amazing they really made everything work together perfectly in the japanese way and i love it but i just wanted to check in and i will see you guys later bye Quick update from Amsterdam at my event with Witchels. As you can see, I changed clothes and this time to this beautiful long sleeve dress from Nelly. And I'm also wearing a hair clip here from Pico. I'm actually in a hurry because I'm heading for dinner at the hotel with Rituals and the rest of the creators. And I'm so excited to spend the rest of the evening with the girls here in Amsterdam. I just need to say that I had the best day with the rituals and the team they are so kind and helpful and open-minded and i filmed as much as i could from today but we started by going to a venue in the Vondel park where we spent the most of our like early afternoon afternoon we got an introduction of their new upcoming products that are launching very soon remember it's the 4th of march there was some activities we could paint on ceramics and make a uh, water based um, letter I don't know it's very Japanese because the collection is Sakura so it's Japanese inspired and it was 100% perfect like everything was perfect it was in the right element of the Japanese vibe like it was so well organized you guys it was beautiful then we had the most delicious lunch which was also Japanese inspired and a ham sash and I painted a yeah the painting with the watercolor and it was so much fun but also pretty hard to do actually then we took a bus to the house of rituals which is located here in the center of Amsterdam and this store oh my god it's beautiful they have like massages and other rituals and we had a breathing exercise and it was just perfect way to end the day and it's also very important for rituals that it's like focus on body mind and soul and it's just in my right elements too but now before i talk too much i will just get out of the door and meet up with the girls downstairs but i just want to check in and then i might film a little bit from the dinner but i'll see you and talk to you soon Bye.
guys so i just got back to my new hotel which you guys don't know because i haven't filmed that i checked into a new hotel but i like i said earlier i decided to extend my trip here in amsterdam because now that i'm here i wanted to get the, the most of it and yeah i just love the city so why not i thought um so i'm just here on a little solo trip for two more days until i go back to Copenhagen. and i just had an amazing day with a coffee date with a girl from Instagram called Dasha and then I strolled around, had the massage, did a little shopping and yeah, just enjoy the city and then I met up with two other girls from Instagram one of them is Mandy and I've met her before and then Minu and we met up for a wine or some wine and it was super cute and cozy and we had such a great time together and they were very very nice and now the time is 8.30 and I'm super hungry so I bought a pokeball so I'm already gonna start eating it because I'm so hungry mm, it's really good the rest of the plans for tonight is to sleep in because I'm super tired but thank you for watching I will try to bring you guys along for tomorrow as well good night. morning guys and welcome to another day in Amsterdam today it is Saturday the 24th of February and as you can see, my eyes are a little puffy because I woke up around 6.30 and I haven't slept much this um, week, so I'm a little down on sleep, but it's okay. So now I'm heading out for some breakfast and just strolling around. It's really nice to get some fresh air after a night, good night's sleep. Um, then I'm having some exciting plans, meeting up with some girls later at the market, at a coffee shop. And yeah, I can't wait to catch up with them and just enjoy the city to the fullest. So I'll see you guys later. Amsterdam, rainy and windy, just like Copenhagen. But I just had the loveliest time with Vip and we strolled around the Norte market and had a coffee and catch up and took some photos together. And it was so much fun to see her again because we met up back in September and she's so cute and so nice. And yeah, it was just so nice to see her. And now I'm heading out to see a girl called Lotte and it's the first time that we're meeting each other so I'm gonna meet up with her at Coffee District and I want to try to bring you guys along so that was a little update from me see you later It's my last day in Amsterdam and I'm feeling so sad because I love this city so much. Actually, one of the girls that I met, she said to me that she could see me living here. When she said that, I was like, yeah, I could definitely see myself living here because it has a similar vibe as in Copenhagen with the lifestyle, but it's a bit bigger and yeah, just very cool. I can definitely see myself here. I really love all the nice restaurants, cafes, the people, and just in general the life here. I would, could definitely see myself living here. I totally forgot to update you guys yesterday because I met so many nice girls. Two of them I met before. It's Vip and Natalie. And with Vip we strolled around, went to the market, had some coffee and catch up. And then I later met up with a girl 
called Lotte and we never met before but we just clicked immediately and just kept on talking for the three hours we spent together and I don't know if you know that but it's so amazing when you meet those kind of people and she's so kind and hopefully I get to see her again if I go back here then I met up with Natalie for a quick glass of wine just to catch up on everything and just literally the sweetest girl and I so glad that we connected when I went here the last time and I hope that we get to see each other again soon because her boyfriend lives in Denmark no, her boyfriend is from Denmark so they might go to Copenhagen during the summer I've just been enjoying my days like it was nice to have a more like um, slow days after the busy days with like schedules with rituals and outfit show in Milan uh, but I'm still a little tired I don't know if you can see it but a little bit puppy eyes but yeah I just really enjoyed being back here and I feel I know the city more than the last time I was here so it was nice to like be able to walk around and recognizing the areas and yeah just in general feeling a little bit more like home I don't know if it makes sense but it has been so amazing and I'm so grateful that I'm able to travel with work because that is literally the biggest dream of mine so I'm totally 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 grateful for that um, yeah so and I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of the day and I'm gonna meet up with Kanita we met in Milan and she's from the Netherlands so she will take the train here and we will meet later before that I'm gonna grab some breakfast and a coffee because I need that to wake up properly and I checked out of my other hotel it was a fine hotel the hotel was located in the east area and it was super nice just to stay there by myself but yeah that's a little update and I will try to take you guys along with me as much as I can <laughs> Hello guys, look who I'm with Yay. again! Yes. We so reunited in Amsterdam again! Yeah, so happy, <laughs> so happy to, to see you again! Yeah, me too! Cheers to that! Cheers, Cheers. to reuni reunited the yeah. moment in Amsterdam! Yeah, from Milan to Amsterdam! From Milan to Amsterdam! Yes. After how many days? I saw you at Wednesday! Wednesday, four? four five? Four days! Yeah, four Had nine. to miss you for a Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Had to see you again! Yay! Yay. Super happy! <laughs> 